everyone, it's Miss Laura. Hope you're doing well. I wanted to give you a fun craft today to do at home with the kids, so let's get started. So you're gonna need a couple different supplies. Most of these supplies you're gonna be able to find in your house. So one of the things that you're gonna need is either some tin foil or saran wrap, little pieces, either some rubber bands or some packing tape, some glue and a paintbrush. If you don't have a paintbrush, you can certainly use a Q-tip to spread the glue different pieces of colored tissue paper. And if you don't have tissue paper, you can certainly use um, streamers. If you have streamers at home, that works really well too. You're also gonna need either some dried rice or dried beans, whatever you might have. And you're also going to need something to put down, either newspaper or a uh, garbage bag. You're also gonna need a paper towel, empty paper towel roll, or you can also use empty toilet paper rolls too. I already started with this um, earlier today just to kind of show you what it's gonna look like, um, but we're gonna be making rhythm sticks today. Rhythm sticks, or um, when I was teaching, my kids used to like to call them rain sticks. So let's get started. So as I said, I already started this earlier today. So basically you're just gonna spread, have your child spread the glue on, all over, try to do one little section at a time. And then, real simple, you're just gonna start putting the tissue paper. And it's fine to overlap the tissue paper because a lot of times the colors will bleed through and make new colors. So it kind of makes a really cool design. And so you're gonna make sure that you cover this whole thing up because we want it to be really colorful. So keep adding your tissue paper. And if there's some edges that are sticking up, you can just add a little bit of glue because when it dries, it's gonna dry clear like these did over here that I did earlier. So cover the whole thing. And as you can see, it's starting to make a really cool collage design. So what you're gonna do when you're all done is you're gonna cover one side with either your tin foil or your saran wrap, whatever you have. And so I have tin foil, so I'm gonna use that. And I do not have any tape, so I'm gonna use rubber bands. Parents, you're probably gonna to wanna to use tape with this because we know that your kids will probably start pulling off these rubber bands. Okay, so I have one side covered. So once one side is covered, you can start filling through on the other empty side. So I don't have any dried beans today, so I'm gonna use my dried rice. So we're just going to fill up this rhythm stick with the dried rice. Dried beans tend to make a little bit of a louder sound because they are larger. Okay, I think that's good. And so now we need to cover up this other open side. So I'm gonna take my tin foil again and cover up this other side. Okay, so now that both sides are covered, I have my rhythm stick. Hope you enjoyed this craft and we'll see you soon.